guys how are you today the video is going to be a little bit different um it's going to be a set down video and i'm going to talk about or answer your guys's assumptions about me or rumors about me should i say and if the lighting looks weird it's because i have my computer light and yeah okay so so I asked Instagram and a couple people what some rumors were or um, assumptions were about me. And this is from YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, my family, like people I know. So, and... As I tell you guys these, I'm going to give a little story with a few of them, just so that you guys know. Okay? Okay. The first one is, and, like, kids, kids think this. And I think it's because I do YouTube. You know, we have all kinds of cars. They don't run. Our cars do not run, guys. We have one good car. And that's it. And the rest are bad cars. <laughs> okay. Hey guys, this is our car situation. We have a work van that don't work. The truck we just bought that don't work. The Suburban we bought a year ago that don't work. Our Suburban that used to work that don't work. My car that works. Bill Samurai that don't work. Oh, and then back behind all that is a brown car. Okay. And no, we're not rich. We are well off. Okay, we this week kind of hit us in the ass because hubby got a truck for Valentine's Day, and now like the last three days we've been having to not go to the store, and we're used to going to the store every freaking day, and it's kind of annoying. I don't like to not have money, or at least that little bit of cushion, you know. I, you know what I mean? So, you know, we're not rich. We are, we're well off. Me and my kids are very well taken care of from my husband. Um, the next one is, I don't spend time with my kids. Yes, I spend time with my kids. <laughs> um, I didn't graduate. I did not graduate high school, but I got my GED, and nowadays that's equal. That's more than a high school diploma. This last five years, I also got my associate's degree in business administration out of Kaplan University online. So now I owe seventy thousand dollars for that. <laughs> I don't. I don't. What's the word I'm looking for? I don't wish I didn't get it. I just wish it. Your college degrees and stuff were not so expensive. It, it's ridiculous. <laughs> so, I didn't graduate. I got my GED, but I graduated college. So, um, I think I'm better than people. No, I don't think I'm better than people. I try to stay away from people just because I don't want to be caught up in negativity. I have a lot of old friends that do like hard drugs right now. There's a lot of hard drugs going around in my hometown. So if me not going and hanging out with druggy people is why people are saying I'm better than everybody, then that's just stupid. Um... I'm rude. I can be. You be rude to me. You be rude to my kids. My husband. I can be rude. Um, I only have three kids. No, I don't. I have seven kids. I have Devin is my oldest. And then I have Christina, which is my second oldest. And then I have Isaiah, which is my third oldest. Dominic, Caitlin, Brandon, and Mackenzie. So I have seven kids, and no, Dominic does not live with me, but he is still my kid, whether anybody likes it or not. And you want to tell me he's not my kid, and I will straight up 
tell you where to stick it because he's my kid whether you think he is or not. And that is a very sensitive subject in my heart. Okay. Okay, somebody said my favorite food is steak, and you are damn well right. My favorite food is steak. And if it if I get it from the Golden Crow, I like it medium to medium well. If I make it at home, I like it about medium. I work? No, I don't work. I do YouTube and I sell Pink Zebra, but I don't have a 9-to-5 job. I am a stay-at-home mom. That's a hard enough job as it is. Um, okay, now, now we're going to get to the difficult questions, okay? I'm a druggie. Um, no, I'm not. Actually, today, 19 years ago, I... Got woke up at 4 o'clock in the morning with cops pounding on my door because I had a meth lab. And I went to jail and I was facing 2 to 32 years in prison. And I'm not going to talk too much on this because I probably will start crying. But... That was 19 years ago. I've had two setbacks. And, um, yeah. And I feel really bad for myself for those two setbacks. But at that time that I did the setbacks. I didn't care about my life, you know what I mean? I didn't care what happened to me. But I'm not a druggie. Okay. I smoke marijuana. Yes, I do smoke marijuana. I... Yes, marijuana is a drug. It's not a hard drug. I think it's just like a cigarette, you know, in my mind. Some people, if you're a beginner smoker, you're gonna get that head high. I don't get high off of weed. I've smoked for a very long time, and I don't get high off of it. It helps my, I'd say, mental. It don't help pain-wise, but it does help mentally. Um, and yes, I'm not going to hide it from nobody anymore. Yes, I do smoke weed. It's legal. I'm 38 years old. My kids know about it. My husband knows about it. The cops know about it. Social services knows about it. I don't think I have to hide it from anybody. So, yeah, I do. And this is the last one. And this is one of the harder ones, too. And it says, I've been to prison. And yes, I have been to prison. I, for the meth lab, I got six years in Department of Corrections. I was in there for um, about 18 months the first time, and then I went to like a behavior modification program. And I was there for 16 months, and I left because my son got sick, and they didn't want to take me to the hospital. Um, and then I didn't complete the program, so I had to go back to prison. So I went to another facility for a little over a year. So I spent about three years away from home for the meth lab. I got very, very lucky. Very lucky. On all sides, all sides, I didn't die. My son's okay, and I didn't spend very long in prison, and I'm clean right now, so I got lucky on all sides. And that's everything, guys. That's everything. So, I don't do drugs. 
I smoke marijuana, yeah, who cares? Uh, I think as long as I'm not hurting anybody with it and I'm not forcing it on anybody, I'm not saying, here, smoke it, then there would be a problem, you know what I mean? But, um, I'm not rich, sorry. I'm well off. I'm a druggie now. I don't spend time with my kids. That's, that can't be more further from the truth. I'm like constantly with my kids, unless they're at school. Um, I've been to prison, yes. Um, I didn't graduate. Um, I did graduate. I'm stupid. No, I'm not stupid. I don't even think I said that one, but no, I'm not stupid. I only have three kids. No, I have seven kids. My favorite food is steak. Yeah, damn straight my favorite food is steak. <laughs> I work. Um, I work on my family and my house. If that's work, yeah, it's work. So, yeah, I work on my family and my house. I'm rude. I can be rude. Um, you push the wrong buttons, and I'm going to be very rude. I think I'm better than people. No. I don't think anybody is better than anybody. Um... And I don't see how people could say this because just because I'm clean and if you're watching this and you're doing drugs, I'm not better than you. I just found a better way to cope with the stuff that's going on inside of my life. You know what I mean? And if it was not for my sisters for turning me in, then I don't know where I would be. If it wasn't for my husband loving me and showing me that, that I am able to be loved and I don't need to do that stuff, then I don't know where I would be. I think I might still, I don't know where I would be actually. I'm not going to say I might still be on the drugs because I would really wish and hope to God I wouldn't be. But if it wasn't for those three people, then I don't, I don't know where I would be. Um... I smoke marijuana? Yes, I smoke marijuana, okay? And I only smoke marijuana. I drink a couple beers every now and then. That does not make me a bad person. If you smoke marijuana, that does not make you a bad person. If you smoke cigarettes, that don't make you a bad person. I ain't gonna judge you. Please don't judge me. And please don't judge me from the stuff that I said in this video. Because... It was a time in my life that I did not know how to cope with stuff. And I just went down the rabbit hole. And But I came out of the rabbit hole to a better person. And now I have seven beautiful kids, a husband, a house. A house that we're buying. Not one car that we are paying on. I know I already said that they don't run, but still, they're all ours. Um, I don't think I'm better than anybody. I just, I just learned how to cope with myself a little bit better than a lot of people know how. So, <sighs> you guys, please like this video, and... If you're the one saying that I'm a druggie still, I can name off a few names in my hometown that says I'm a druggie. I'm not a druggie, okay? I'm not a druggie, okay? I smoke weed. Get it straight. And quit talking shit because it's not nice and it's not cool and it does not make you look cool. It makes you look kind of dumb, actually. But I love you guys. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out. Don't forget to smile and make someone else smile. Love you guys. Bye.